see well, you. Well, this is mine. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. I appreciate the opportunity to thank you for so oh, many things. Oh, it's been my pleasure. Absolutely. Believe me, you're... As you supported me all the way, did an awful lot to oh, well, I've straighten out the to record for us. I'm right, right behind you, Lori. God bless you. Mm -hmm. It's just such right. a to see you. Thank you. Well, thank you. I thank you. heard so much about you. I appreciate very much this opportunity well, to say hello. Do you remember way back in the 60s when I met you in Greenwich with my husband? Yes, at the Gordon Reeds. Yes. And um, a long time ago. <laughs> but you wrote me so many nice letters, and I, have, I treasure them. Um, right. When my daughter was born. And everything. Yes, she was, uh, grew up to vote for you, which I'm very happy to do. For heaven's sakes. Yes, that's a long, long time. But, um, time seems to be going a lot faster. It does indeed. <laughs> and, um, I'm so happy that things are progressing the way we want them to. <laughs> I think. Well, I, I think they are. I hope so. I'll let you know what you stand for, for freedom and democracy. I think that's, what it's, that's what we have to have. Bless you. And uh, I wanted to tell you, too, that I had been so happy because for the first time I felt God was back in my house because you brought it back. <laughs> I doubt that. In fact, I intend to take it to Geneva with me. Oh, good. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> thank you. Now, listen, thank you for all you've done. It's been a service above and beyond. woman just all on her own puts up money and buys advertisements and everything and having to do with Nicaragua and things like that like for lobbying purposes I mean she just uh, goes out of her way and does that thousands and thousands of dollars you know what I've been seeing more and more lately support Nicaraguan freedom fighters uh, that could unless that's about the heritage one that could well be one yeah, of them yeah. seeing a lot of them Taylor, who's that? Who's that standing over there? Should have had Lucky in here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she calls him the boss. Mr. President, this is my mother, Pauline Coon. Hello there. Nice to meet you. It was nice to meet you. That's more with this background. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to get up at five in the morning and do chores on the farm anymore, so there's one right here. <laughs> Stay for that, see? Um, maybe you yeah. ought to get on this side. <laughs> we'll stand here. That's great. That's just perfect. <laughs> Kate, a big smile, okay? Big smile for the camera. <laughs> Kim, you have to smile, too, okay? Smile, Kate. Okay? Thank you. Thank you very well, much. Every morning I bring Lucky over here, teaching yeah. <laughs> teach him to, to her to heal. To heal? And usually over there, then I start giving her to yeah. shake hands. She wouldn't shake hands. She wouldn't shake. To get here to the door, and uh, I stop over here at the door, and there's a short leash, and I turn around, and she's waiting with her paw. Oh. <laughs> See? This yes, your dog persistence. Lucky. And she enjoyed your presence. Yeah. Caitlin gave Lucky a raw eyes on and a bag of gourmet <laughs> dog biscuits. Lucky liked season. your presence. She said thanks. We told her she was coming to see the boss. She asked about Lucky. She's the boss. Well, thanks, Bruce. Yeah. Thanks, Bruce. Thanks, Lucky. Bye. Boss. <laughs>